Hey guys, Marlos517 here bringing you another episode of my series, Things to Build in Minecraft. This time I'm bringing you a lumberjack site. So essentially what we have here is we have a nice fire pit for a lumberjack to hang out with after he gets done processing some wood. Nearby we have the bundled logs, which are from the logs that were chopped down in the area. And then we have a bed that you can crash in at night. And we have a lantern just kind of adding some extra lighting to the area. And so the way I think this can fit in your world is if you have an area where you typically process wood, you know, you go there once in a while, you chop down a bunch of trees, replace them with saplings, and just kind of, you know, you make a routine of going to and from there to accumulate all your wood. You could add this to the area just to kind of give it a nice aesthetic, and it also serves some function. The campfire you can cook on, and you can also use it as a nearby light source. The lantern works as another light source, and then you have a bed here that you can just sleep on. So if it starts to get nighttime and you're a little far from home, you can just crash real quick before the mob spawn and save yourself a headache so overall it's pretty cool and it's got some extra detail that i'll get into as i build it and so yeah i'm gonna show you guys how to build it so first off we're gonna take a shovel here and we're just gonna make a quick plus sign like so then you're gonna take campfire throw it down in the center and then you're gonna go two blocks away and place an oak log this will be your first tipped over tree but it also functions as like a nice area where you know you would pop a squat you know get done with the fire or get done with chopping logs and you're like, yeah, hanging by the fire. So once you get done doing that, you're just going to want to find three other places to put some logs. So I'm going to space out, probably put one here, put another one about here, and then the last one right there. And then next thing you want to do is you want to take your shovel and you're going to want to dig out. You're going to want to go four blocks on one of them, four blocks on another, four blocks on three of them, actually. And then... You're going to go ahead and do five blocks on the last one. So, there we go. And you can do this in whichever way you want. I chose to have these go this way and this go that way. The reason being is so you would think that when the logs get chopped down or the trees get chopped down and the log hits the ground, it's going to leave a depression in the ground. I think this just adds a little bit of extra detail that just kind of, you know, just adds a little extra to it, just adds a little more for your eye to catch, and I think it looks pretty cool as a whole. And so once you're done doing that, you're going to go ahead and take some oak leaves and just add it to the surrounding area of the little depression you made so this is essentially you know the branches and the leaves that were still on the tree that just kind of are nearby again it's just another thing to catch your eye and just adds a little extra detail and so we're just going to add that to the area there's no right or wrong way to do this you just kind of want to add this in whichever way you see fit so you can see i did that as such next i'm going to go ahead and just take a lantern throw it on one log you can place it on whichever one you want i just figured that one is kind of like a nice space away and it just kind of keeps the light congregated in one area and you know overall it's pretty cool and the last thing you want to do is you're just going to take your logs and just make the horizontal log bundle so typically i'm going to do three logs that are of four in length and the reason being is because you can see that, you know, we made four of these at four in length, then one in five. The three on the bottom are going to be our four long logs. And, you know, those are the ones that uh, fell right here. And then our top one is going to be the longest one that kind of overhangs a little. So it's going to go right here. And one, that's two, three, four, five. And so you can see this is where it's going to sit like that that would be the fifth one and the last thing you want to do is you want to take our ladder here and you're just going to put it on each side like so and then you're going to take your railing oh it has begun to rain well that just that just ruined my day all right you're going to add that in and that's it for your bundled log and the last thing you need to do is just place a bed somewhere so since mine is a little bit different than that one i'm going to place it like this and that just adds a little area to sleep. You can add it wherever you see fit. You can build a little house nearby if you wanted. This is just my take on it. Cool little lumberjack area that you can hang out at when you're chopping your wood. And it just adds a little extra. You know, you got the fire pit. You got the lantern. Just adds a nice little area. And once you have all the trees, the surrounding trees in the area around it, it'll just add to it so much more. So that's going to be it for the video, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please do leave a like. Let me know what you think in the comment section. Also, if you have any suggestions for future builds, please let me know. And I encourage you to please go check out my other content i have posted on my channel i have some fortnite rainbow six other videos that you guys may enjoy and yeah that's it for the video i hope you guys enjoy see you next time